Imagine a place so deep, sunlight never dares to reach it, a place where time seems to stop, where human footsteps echo into a darkness that hasn't seen life for millions of years. This is not fiction. This is Krubera Cave, Earth's deepest abyss. And what scientists have found inside may just rewrite everything we know about our planet. But Krubera is not just a cave. It's a living nightmare in a scientific treasure trove. Today, we're going 7,200 feet underground to uncover the secrets that only a handful of humans have ever witnessed. Are you ready to descend? Krubera Cave, also known as the Voronya Cave, meaning Cave of the Crows, lies hidden in the Arabica Massif of the Western Caucasus in Georgia, near the Black Sea. It was named after Russian geographer Alexander Kruber. But this isn't just any cave. It's the deepest known cave on Earth, deeper than the Grand Canyon, deeper than some parts of the ocean floor. But for decades, Krubera was a myth among speleologists, a whisper of a void beneath the Earth that swallowed light and sound. In the 1960s, it was first explored by Soviet teams, but the equipment back then barely scratched the surface. Then in the early 2000s, international cave divers returned, not with picks and torches, but with GPS, sonar, and an obsession to find the true bottom of the world. Descending into Krubra isn't like walking into a tourist cave. You don't find smooth paths or railings here. You find vertical drops, freezing floods, razor-sharp rocks, and absolute silence. Over 2,000 feet deep, you pass through vertical chimneys so tight, cavers have to remove their backpacks and crawl headfirst. Temperatures drop to near freezing. Oxygen thins. Communication fails. And just when you think it can't get worse, the cave becomes wet. Flooded tunnels called siphons force divers to carry scuba gear into tight, claustrophobic chambers filled with icy water. One wrong move, one burst of panic, and Krubera will claim you. In 2004, a Ukrainian-led team made history. After weeks inside the cave, they reached an astonishing depth. 2,080 meters, or 6,824 feet. Krubera became the first cave known to reach over two kilometers underground, but the cave wasn't done. In 2012, renowned cave explorer Gennady Samakin descended even deeper, reaching 2,197 meters, or 7,208 feet. He was diving in complete darkness through a water-filled tunnel now known as the Terminal Sump. He had reached the deepest known point any human had ever gone beneath the Earth's surface on land. But even then, Krubera kept her secrets. How can anything survive in such darkness, pressure, and isolation? And yet, life found a way. Scientists discovered previously unknown species of amphipods, tiny shrimp-like creatures. Thriving in Krubera's underground rivers, they are blind, pale, and adapted to total darkness. Their existence raises profound questions. Did life originate deep underground? Could similar organisms exist beneath the surfaces of Mars or Europa? Krubera is not just a cave. It's a biological time capsule, untouched by sunlight, pollution, or evolution as we know it. Descending into Krubera isn't just physically dangerous. It's psychologically brutal. Imagine spending days in complete darkness, hearing only your own heartbeat, your own thoughts, claustrophobia, hallucinations, panic attacks, cavers have reported losing their sense of time and even reality deep within Krubera. One diver described it like this. It's like being buried alive, but you're choosing to go deeper. For years, Krubera held the record for the deepest cave on Earth. But nature loves surprises. In 2018, Veryovkina Cave, also in the Arabica Massif, was explored to a depth of 2,212 meters, beating Krubera by a mere 15 meters. So is Krubera still special? Absolutely. Veryovkina may be slightly deeper, 
But Krubera remains more dangerous, more mysterious, and more biologically fascinating. Besides, Krubera may still hide deeper passages, unreachable with today's technology. Its deepest tunnels remain unexplored due to flooding and extreme pressure. So what lies even deeper? Could there be caves that descend three kilometers? Are we only scratching the surface of Earth's true underworld? New sonar technologies and robotic divers are being developed to explore submerged cave systems. The future may bring autonomous machines capable of surviving depths no human can endure. And then there's the question no one dares to ask. What if Krubera leads to something we weren't meant to find? Krubera is not just a hole in the earth. It's a reminder of how little we truly know about the planet we live on. It hides life in places where life shouldn't exist. It tests the limits of the human body and mind, and it dares us to keep going deeper into the unknown. Would you dare to descend into the abyss? If you were fascinated by Krubera's terrifying depths, there's more where that came from. Hit that subscribe button and explore the unseen world with us, one mystery at a time. Comment below, would you descend into Krubera if given the chance?